Hey, it's Aaron. I'm just driving. I'm a little uh, sweaty. I just played some ball hockey with some guys outside. Get a stick and throw a ball around. Okay, how to protest properly. And, uh, hey, I'm not a professional protester, but these are some tips. Now, uh, yes, we want to uh, advocate for, for certain things, and I'm not going to tell you what to protest about, but you think you know, read between the lines. I don't want to get censored or anything like that. But if you want to protest something, yes, you can go out in public and put signs up and smash things, but that's not the way to fight things. What we want to do is you want to you want to fight for choice, okay? You don't really want to fight to uh, get rid of things. I'm just trying to be sensitive here. Okay, basically choice. Choice is what you're fighting for, okay? Number, number, so no, that's number one. You just want your choice. Use, and number two, which is kind of attached to choice, is the world is pro-choice. You can choose to do anything you want in life. So use that against them. We want choice for said protest, right? Okay, so that's number one. Uh, number two, there are strength in numbers. Uh, so if you're a part of a large company that wants to mandate whatever it is, right? You want to find people and form a group of people. So you have power in numbers, right? And so also, so you don't feel like you're alone, but start a group. Number two, in this group, you don't want to just vent to each other. And of course you want to support each other, but what the purpose of the group is to find a legal backbone. So what are some contracts that we can present to our employer? What are some, some things that we can present to uh, people so they have they know they have a choice and they know that they're empowered, okay? So number one, advocate, advocate for choice. Number two, find a group and find some legal ins and outs on how to do things properly. Going on the street and just yelling, it's kind of like going to war with a hockey stick and just smashing things. You're really not going to do much. You're going to cause a scene, but you're not really going to get down to the nitty gritty. You got to get some paperwork in place. You got to say, okay, look, us 500 in this particular company, we're going to walk out if, you know, if you do this such and such mandate and actually I heard uh, from a sister that that's what her husband did they were a part of a welding company and uh, he said you know we're all gonna walk out if you mandate this and the company kind of turned around and said okay I guess we're not gonna mandate this so there's uh, strength in numbers and advocate for choice know what you're willing to sacrifice um, as well um, there are certain things to fight for and there are certain things to let go and so know your line and and then stand firm on it and another thing too is I was telling this to my wife and this is not just a personal thing this is a humanitarian thing when it affects your children and the people after you this is something worth fighting for when it comes to mandations and, and things like that so that's how you do it and that's why you do it Focus your attention in the right way. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm not against protesting, I put, like going in the streets and putting up signs, that's great, but that's not gonna get the job done. And when it, <clears throat> when it come to, came, comes to the hubba the children hubba in Ontario, uh, what I had to do to not, put the, not do that for my kids and to put them in school is I had to go to City Hall and sign a piece of paper and get it stamped for like $30, and then that's it, and then I present that to the school and you're done. Somebody before me, some, somebody before my time did that and fought for that so that I can go and just simply walk in and sign a piece of paper. And so that's what you want. You want to get a piece of paper that you can present to your said employer or whatever and says, I have choice. And of course, they're trying to take that away. And I know, I know that, but that's what we're gonna, that's what you got to fight for. Everybody deserves a choice in whatever they're going to do because they've got to live with their own choice. So um, hope that helps. That's how to protest. Oh, and one more thing. Thank you for those who supported me on PayPal. Uh, some of you didn't leave your emails. I want to just say thank you. So shoot me an email if you if you um, donated and supported in that way. I'm truly blessed and humbled. Uh, I just look at this as my job now. I'm telling people about Jesus and um, getting them ready and encouraging the bride of Christ. So um, go Jesus, go. God bless.